What's up, everybody? OMB. Hey, look, I appreciate y'all subscribing to the channel. Do subscribe if you're not subscribed. And hit that bell icon so you can be notified for future videos. Yo, I'm about to hit y'all with some real stuff. I don't even know if y'all can handle this, B. It might be way too much for y'all. But it's straight real. And I'm talking to my people. You know what I'm saying? So don't get offended. But uh, my people are cliche type people. We regurgitate the same stuff all around the United States. Even the people who come here from other blacks, from other places, once they pick up on whatever language you're using, they start doing it. You know what I'm saying? So, here's something that's very cliche that a lot of black people, people in general, but I'm talking to my people. I ain't talking to nobody else. Black people love to say, and this society loves this love to say, accept me for who I am. Okay. For everybody else, y'all can run with that. But for black people, I got an issue with that. Because y'all say, accept me for who I am. Well, who the hell are you? You don't even know who the hell you are. <laughs> so who am I accepting? What am I accepting? Now, this is also for spiritual people. Because the spiritual folks going to know what I'm talking about. When you come into this flesh Are you angry? Are you mad? You don't know what none of that stuff is, right? So then therefore As you grow up and as you get older These behaviors are learnt So if you're an asshole Or a jackass, whatever one, both Well, you might be all of that You've learned to be that. So I ask you again. Who the hell are you? Because when you come from the essence. You ain't mad or angry. There ain't none of that. You happy as can be. Even when you're growing up. But then as you start to start. Realize things. And start learning and understanding. And start to get the meanings of these words. And watch people behave in a certain way. In these situations, you learn that behavior and you become that. Or you might latch on to that and just stick with that. Which might be some bull. You know what I'm saying? Which in a lot of times it is. So, when you say to me, a person who know better, to accept you for who you are. You're saying that to the wrong person. Because you don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. But I do know one thing You became what you are You know what I'm saying So you're asking me to accept you For what you became Not what you are or who you are You know what I'm saying And I don't accept most people for what they became Especially when they're on that nonsense And they negative You know what I'm saying OMB signing out peace